you guys come on through. I think actually we don't have much time for any other ads because we're going to be getting right into the game here. This is uh, yeah. oh, this big is one. yeah, this is numbers versus Zamba. If you're just tuning in now, this is losers finals. Like, it's not too unusual to see Zomba here, but Numbers, you know, putting a really good show yeah. on to... Nah. Uh, <laughs> okay. <laughs> Maybe a bit too low. I mean, for... I guess take it. Take the stock yeah. trade. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, we're playing two stock meta. Damn. We Smash love, 4 all over. Yeah, we love that game. Ooh. Okay, well, one of the risks of two we stock... We love is that, that game. <laughs> Yeah, we love this one too. Now, that is the risk of playing a two-stock game is that all of a sudden something like that might happen to you and the comeback that you need to make Yo, is that much <laughs> These that players more are going after each other. <gasps> okay, I love the high recovery from Zomba, recognizing that numbers really wanted to. Yeah, sort but of you only have so much fuel to go high. Hey, look, yeah. look. How much time has passed, Salty? This Four stocks are gone. We're in a minute, and we're already up to the last stock for both players. This isn't even like a, oh, you know, total slaughter fest. No, yeah. they're just like, this is like the type of slaughterhouse where the pig and the butcher take turns. Yeah, this is, what the heck? <laughs> but this is what we call efficiency. <laughs> Probably not with the butcher, but. <laughs> All right. Zamba trying to play with more space, more control, and numbers. Known for like more of his camping style, just now getting into people's faces and boxing with them. The thing is that I love that approach just because of the fact that uh, Rob is kind of a zoner who beats other zoners. Between Gyro, between uh, the laser, there are so many things that numbers can't just hang back and do whatever he wants. Yeah, no. That some salutation is active right oh, now. Oh, just caught the jump. Yeah, and you can see numbers kind of throw up his arms with that one. Like, yeah. ah, come on. Yeah, and he did the signal for the run back. Yeah, well, here's our game one PS2 that we were talking about. Yeah, he and he just got deep breathing too. Yeah, I like the bait right there. He didn't even hit his shield. He like whiffed it, and then he was like, okay. Now that he faded back. Yeah, and then he did like a dash back, and then he's like, okay, I know. I know you're going to feel safe right here, so I'm going to hit you with something slick. All right, yeah, and now get right. That's actually, so it's funny. Game one started off with uh, numbers getting lasered right at the start. Game two, he knows to shield. He's yeah. learning. He's adapting. Well, let's see how much he's going to have to do a lot of adapting right now because 56% right out of the gate. Zombo looking much better than he did in game one. At least yeah. at the start. Game. Actually, I'm more amazed that Zombo was able to grab that Nair. It's really hard, and numbers use the spaces so well. Oh, no shield. Oh, okay. He's yeah. actually getting his ability back. That was really smart from numbers. The, uh, Yo, you cannot challenge that. Yeah, it's, I think it's frame five. Also, frame, arm intangible. Yeah, like, you don't fight her there. She's a monster. <laughs> no Nicki Minaj. <laughs> oh, I also love the recoveries from numbers. He's avoiding these downers every time. But, oh, there's more than one way that those recoveries can be punished. And Numbers is just getting knocked off stage time and time again, 139%. I think a forward it will probably kill him at yeah, this point. unfortunately getting the sour spot. Nair hitting the ledge. And the snipe, the laser from across the universe connecting onto Numbers. And, you know, he did. we did see him, you know, get a really clean response in that last game. But this time around, he... He needs to keep doing it. Oh, oh my God. Surprised he actually finished the jab combo. Yeah, so, so yeah. I don't think you can't jab lock after three. So yeah. he's like, okay, I might as well just finish it here. I wonder if there was maybe another punish he could have gone for. Maybe, but it would have been through a check chase, maybe, most likely. Yeah, and this is just not looking really good for numbers, but looking great for Zamba. Yeah, at the same time, if numbers manages to take this stock right here, but. He's trapped at the corner once again, and he's kind of conditioned. Wow, that was so good. Did, did he parry and still get punished? <laughs> it looked like that. Not all parries are great. <laughs> well, because he crossed him up, which was really good. Oh, right. I think it's shield poked. Oh, that's okay, yeah. Oh, Side God. B just taking it right there. Zama, Zama just doing a great job. Life trapping, taking the stock right there. And he had gone for that downer. You saw him time and time again. None of them have been working, but he only needs for it to work once for it to oh. really work out. 
Yeah, and number, you usually see numbers get a kill off these up smashes, but when we fit does not be having enough strength to kill the heavy Rob. Oh, he wants to be punishing it. There's the he gets the parry, but back hit of up tilt is oh sorry, F tilt is not quite enough. But at this point, ooh, I think he wants deep breathing just to give him more kill options. But look at this, the pressure right now is on, but not letting him have a chance to. Oh. All right, F tilt taking it right there. 35 percent this is doable salty oh, absolutely especially when you start getting those low percent grabs deep breathing right oh <gasps> landing there oh there's some of these combos that we've seen when numbers you know if the opponent misses attack on that platform we've seen opponents take 65. yeah or but... have lost docks from it gyro in hand okay Zamba just knows he's gonna roll there, so covered it with up smash. Unfortunately, he's not gonna kill right there, but definitely has been scouted out. That's the exact same thing we saw him go for before with that down tilt, trying to punish the jump into back air, but numbers very smartly holding shield. But those adaptations to good, but will it be enough because he's surviving, but he needs to have things go turn around. Yeah, you Dang. cannot do that. Oh. oh my God, just living. Yeah, he and needs deep to deep breathing. breathing. Okay, just sniped out. Just Both scary. players don't want to do anything. Yeah, Numbers trying to find maybe an up tilt to catch dropping shield, but just barely misspaces it. And these players looking for their out. Yeah. Numbers is right back here. Yeah, and now deep breathing is done. But he's he probably jump. not going to need it, but he still goes for it anyway. Okay, deep breathing's back. That was so risky going for that deep breathing that situation. Somehow yeah. he manages to shield it. He, that's gonna be a game two victory for numbers. Yeah, we're going game three. Yeah, we're definitely going game three. That definitely looked like a super slow option. It felt like he could have shield grabbed that one. Yeah. Yeah, I, th I think the shield yeah, grab. Because you have to drop, shield, you have though. to drop shield, and then you have to start with down smash. So that's like 11 frames to drop shield, and then yeah. whatever move. It and also number shielded right after. Yeah. The, but would it have up throw killed at that percent? Well, even if up throw wouldn't have killed, it's like you're still getting them all stage. Yeah. Um, and now, yeah, we're into game three between these two. If there is a timeline where Numbers manages to beat two of his bracket demons in the same tournament, it's going to be this one. Yeah, no, this tonight's the night, man. Yeah, get up attack has invincibility. Mm. Uh, I also do want to just point out, so normally when Numbers gets hit off stage, that's actually one of the best times for him to get deep breathing. But because of the fact that Rob has things like Gyro and also that laser, you know, he's yeah. not really able to get it. He's actually struggling to find times to, you know, get that buff working in his favor. Yeah, even arm rotor, like, the move Rob's most infamously known for can just, like, end stock. So it's definitely a scary time for, to be numbers. Yeah, and trapped at the ledge, but not necessarily suffering that much for it. He is alive, and now with deep breathing, this is actually threatening the kill onto Zomba. Yeah, the whiff just not working out for him right there. Yeah, and manages to roll back on the ledge, but it's just not working out, losing that exchange. And that's what Zomba was scouting out before. You saw how numbers just rolled at ledge. He's going to do it once more, this time actually just dumping out. Zamba has some of these habits scouted, and the grab into up throw, taking the stock. Yeah, we now have numbers. He has to once again make it. He did it last game, I believe. He lost the first stock. Managed to still get the comeback going, but this time around, look at Thomba just putting up so much ledge pressure. Numbers can't quite figure out how to get off. Yeah, this is not looking good for him. We saw before that, like the game he won, he was so aggressive. And it was just more in Zama's face, but now he's trying to lay back. And it just might not work out for him. 71, 72%. And just counting. Ooh, oh, that down tilt was so good. And numbers, look at the way he's struggling. 104%. Yeah, Zama, this is like a different. He has a lockdown now. Yeah, this is kind of what we normally see a player like Zomba do to numbers. Three stocks to one. Numbers has had a fantastic run tonight. Is it going to be cut short in this game three against Zomba, though? Yeah, it just might be, man. Okay, F-Tilt taking it. 
Went. That's the first stock of many he would have to take if he wants yeah. to stay alive in bracket. Interesting that he actually went for the sun salutation as opposed to deep breathing. But these lower percents, especially, that's when deep breathing can really work out because the, the combos just become disgustingly powerful. Yeah. Oh, no, it definitely does. And I, Zamas is not letting him the chance to like get it. I mean, look at this numbers at ledge once more. Even when he's getting the parry, the spacing is too good from Zomba. Numbers struggling to punish him at any point. All right. Is he going to catch him? No, he does not. Oh, good spacing to avoid the down air. But, like, it's it's just delaying the inevitable right now. It feels like damage just being dealt onto numbers time and time again. Even when he's air dodging these projectiles being thrown at him, this is the first time we've actually seen him get a little bit of something started, but even then, cut off so short. Yeah, it might be too late. Because already having 92% dealt onto you, 102, and just being ledge trapped by Rob, that's not a situation I want to be at. Oh, no, it numbers. I think he's sick of it at this point. And even now, if he manages to take this stock, he still is at 143 trying to like deal with Zomba at zero. This is looking like it might be the end. That dash attack, even with deep breathing, it's not enough. Yeah, Rob's just such a heavy character, able to live to pretty high percents. Oh, man, that up air still not doing it. Yeah, it's just not working out. Okay, oh. just got shot up. All right, manages to get both the sun and deep breathing, yeah. and it's the sun that ends up taking the stock. We do have one stock apiece for both these players, but the amount of the, the room for error, you know, for numbers is like zero. Yeah, no, you, you can't have any. That's it. Yeah, that's that's got to be it. Tombstone pile driver off on the top platform. Yeah, and that's going to be Zomba taking it, managing to get himself into grand finals. But, man, numbers had such a fantastic run tonight, getting some yeah. really fantastic wins. But uh, just being kind of coming up short at the very end here, Zomba, one of his uh, bracket demons, still remains. Yeah, nah, nah. Is it a bracket demon? <laughs> is the buzz actually a bracket demon? <laughs> oh, no, I'm talking about Zomba. Oh. He remains. Oh. Zomba remains. Okay, my bad. Yeah.